So this is the ridge pole. Um, on this build, it's made in three sections. There's the, the main middle section, which is a straight ridge, and then we've put on these two curved sections to create the profile of the roof. The ridge pole on this building is quite unusual because we've got the main section, which is a straight ridge, and then we're dropping away with two curves to form the shape of the roof. And we've put a bridle joint in here. This is where you have one long tenon for a big deep open mortise and then it's pegged through in two places. Some pegs here. This will be trimmed off and this will form the actual curved shape of our roof. The other thing is these what I call the horns of the crux. These will also end up being trimmed off all the way along the ridge um, so they're at a, a uniform height and the um, roof rafters can attach into the top of the ridge pole. As it works its way down between the crux, it's pegged into both crux and then dips away to form the final curve at the bottom of the roof. We'll then mirror this curve shape with the rafters which we've been steam bending um, to create a, a sort of curved oval, almost sort of turtle shell roof over the top of the building. 